parabola with the vertex being at h and k. So yesterday we looked at everything being at the origin. Today we're going to look at the vertex with h and k. So parabola is opening in a vertical direction. Yesterday we looked at up and down. Our vertex is at h and k. Our equation is y equals 1 over 4p times x minus h squared plus k. So we're using what we worked with yesterday, the 1 over 4p. We're throwing in our h and our k. Our focus is going to be at h and k plus p. Directrix is opposite direction of the focus, and it is y equals k minus p. So it looks similar to yesterday, and it looks similar to the h and k items that we were looking at previously. So we have a parabola that's opening up. Here's our vertex at h and k. We have a focus at h and k plus p. And our directrix is opposite direction, equal distance from the vertex to the focus. And it's a line. And this is y equals k minus p. This graph is if p is greater than 0. Now we'll look at the graph if p is less than 0. So our parabola would face down. Our vertex is at our maximum. And our vertex is h and k. Our focus falls within the parabola. And our points for the focus are h and k plus p. Your directrix is in the opposite direction, same distance away as the focus is from the vertex. And this line is y equals k minus p. Now, let's look at parabolas opening in the horizontal direction. Our vertex is still at h and k. Our equation, remember when these open side to side in horizontal, it's an x equals, it is still 1 over 4p times the quantity y minus k squared plus h. We have the focus at h plus p and k. And our directrix is x equals h minus p. If our graph opens to the right, then p is greater than 0. And it would look something like this. Vertex is at h and k. Our focus falls within the opening of the parabola. This is h plus p and k. And the directrix, equal distance away, as the focus is from the vertex. And this is 
x equals h minus p. If p is less than 0, 